Hello everyone, I'd like to show you today a cold face support, very common cold face support for a regenerative thermal oxidizer. Right now we're looking at the poppet valve assembly that feeds a 40,000 SCFM regenerative thermal oxidizer. The boards are covering up the throats. Uh, we have it prepped for storage in anticipation of refurbishing it in the near future. Right now those boards cover up the throats that feed the main combustion chamber that we're going to look at over here. Again, this one is prepped for storage, and the throats uh, that of the poppet valves feed these uh, boarded up openings. I'm going to come down to the area where I have it opened up. This unit would use saddles, ceramic saddles, uh, as the ceramic media for the heat transfer and heat exchanger of this RTO. We're looking at the cold face support, and right here you can see that there's posts that are distributed throughout the base of the coal face. And those posts are supported by structural members underneath the sheet that you can see there. And then those support a perforated plate that then supports the ceramic media. You can see it's very well distributed as far as the supports. Because the media is heavy, it's about 40 to 50 pounds per cubic foot for saddle media. And the structure of members needs to be strong enough to support that. Hope that's good information for you. Thank you for joining us and seeing what a common cold face support might look like on a regenerative oxidizer.